The government has suspended the Mwia resettlement exercise about a day after clashes left four people with gunshot wounds. The Thursday suspension followed consultations between Lands and Interior Cabinet Secretaries Verada Caroni and Fred Mashangai. Interior Ministry spokesperson Wendun Joka announced the decision via Twitter saying it was immediate. The four people were shot on Wednesday as protesters prevented beneficiaries from being shown their land. Heavily armed security agents accompanied the 7,232 people to the location of the property in Mbir South, Mbu County. Mwia MCA Harrison Maluko said the four were shot at Mashamba area. Maluko told the Star on phone that the settlers were unarmed but police opened fire on them. He said a fifth person was beaten up and left in critical condition. All the victims were taken to Gate Gay White Rose Hospital and later transferred to other hospitals. The MCA identified two of the victims as a Dint Modalo, 41, from Kambiti, who was shot in the stomach, and Pius Maza, 41, who was shot in the chest. Dennis Mriti, 20, from Mashamba area was shot in the hand and stomach while Kennedy Muuvi from Kamwea also suffered a stomach wound. Maluko condemned the shooting. Noting the residents are fighting displacement as they have lived in the area for years. The land should have been divided for everybody living there to get an allocation, he said. Deputy County Commissioner Beverly Opwara and OCPD Ahmed Mohammed did not answer calls and SMSs for comment on the incident. Reports indicated they went to the scene to restore order. Kiranaga Governor Anway Iguru earlier warned that the resettlement will certainly explode and result in bloodshed because Kikuyu elders from Kiranaga County were not involved. Mbu Land Executive Joss Fat Kai Thambu, however, says the land was demarcated according to the constitution and laws and that notices were published in the media. He also said all stakeholders and relevant government officers were involved. Kai Thambu says all those who deserve the land were considered and that those complaining are not residents but people with selfish interests. He regretted that some of the violence in the area is fanned by politicians pursuing their own interests and individuals who have been farming on large pieces of free land, who want the status quo to remain.